Hello and welcome to today's comparison video. Which API will best run Rainbow Six Siege on low-end systems? Will it be the Vulkan API or will it be the DirectX 11 API? This has been the only benchmarking test that has surprised me so much in my whole life. Trust me, if you think you know which is better or which will prevail, I say think again my friend. Wait, 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 wait. Only 20% of you guys are actually subscribed to me? The rest of you? I'm watching you. All jokes aside, do sub if you like the content I am putting out, or at least like the video so the YouTube gods will bless this video and put it out to everyone's recommendations. Anyways, back to the video. First of all, this is the test system. The CPU, GPU, motherboard, and RAM specifications should be up on the screen right now. This would be considered a low-end or an entry-level PC. In short, for those of you who do not want to continue watching the video any longer, Rainbow Six Siege performs better on the DirectX 11 API. For those of you who want to know more, please continue watching this video. The Vulkan API is well known for granting games with more FPS than DirectX. So how can the DirectX 11 API outperform the Vulkan API? That's not even possible, right? After spending countless hours trying to find the reason why DirectX 11 performs better on this test system, I came up with a conclusion. It turns out the Vulkan API is good for medium to high end PCs, but it's not as effective for low end PCs. In some cases, it is either on par with the DirectX 11 performance or worse. And it happened to be in my case that the Vulkan API performance was worse. On the tests that I've done on low, medium and high settings, it can be seen that the DirectX performance on the right hand side is way better than the Vulkan performance. The low settings test that I've done had a difference of 16 FPS, medium had 15 and high had 10. I am not entirely sure what causes these results, but if I had to guess then I would say this entry level test system does not have enough processing power to be able to fully utilize the Vulkan API. However, I am leaving this open to anyone who might know why this is the case. Let this video be open to ev everyone's opinions and feedback. If you know why these results turn out like they did, then please comment down below so we can all gain some knowledge about this. Summing up the video, for this setup or a similar low end system, according to the results, it is better to play Rainbow Six Siege on DirectX 11 API. However, personal tests should be done to confirm these results. Once again, this video is open to everyone's opinions and knowledge, so please comment down below if you know what causes the Vulkan API to be less effective on the setup. I hope this video was useful. If so, please give it a like or let me know what I can improve for next time. And also subscribe if you like the content I am putting out. I will see you in the next one.